T20. Chemistry T20. How to remember PKA values of phenols and ethanol. Or the nitrophenol. Paranitrophenol. Metanitrophenol. Dear students, in case of orthonitrophenol, paranitrophenol, metanitrophenol, the operation in the first part, look at this. Nitrogen, atomic number 7, oxygen, O2, so that's why this is 7 by 2. The pKa value of orthonitrophenol is 7 by 2. And in case of nitrophenol, nitrogen, 7, and P, how do you write P? This is P, P is nothing but 1, 7 by 1. And in case of metanitrophenol, see, this is metanitrophenol M. If I write like this, it becomes 8, right? Which one I have added? And the flipped 3, I have added to 3, that became 8. So that is 8 by 3. Once again, in case of metanitrophenol, and uh, this is metanitrophenol, this is M, and uh, inverted 3. And again, I have added some more thing that we can eight eight point three in case of nitrophenol, nitrophenol that is beta nitrophenol eight point three the pK value. Now, in case of phenol, in case of phenol, only without nitrogen, the phenol value is one zero ten. And crystal, are the I told you, without nitrogen. Take this value as 10 and here oxygen is there, oxygen value is equal to 7.5. And in case of metacrisol, m crisol, crisol 10 and this is m, m crisol. This is 10. And last one, tananitrophenol, sorry, paracrisol, that is again crisol. That is 10, again paramagnetism, paramagnetism that is 2, oxygen paramagnetic, 10 by 2. We have last and final that is ethanol C2H5H. The magical trick in case of ethanol is two straight lines. Look at this one. I have extended this one like this. 15.9. The pKa value for C2H5OH is 15.9. Two straight lines. That's it.